Hello everyone and hello everybody. It's Saturday and of course we're here on the tube doing it make it do what it do and we're gonna be talking about celebrity big brother okay i tried to watch this show y'all i just can't get into it i can't get into it so y'all just gonna have to help me with this but i do know the guy that i wanted to win he don't got casted off and i'm still trying to figure that one out cynthia cynthia bailey girl little miss muffet sat on her tuffet eating her curse and web and long came up beside her uh, wait a minute Along came beside her, there was a spider. Wait a minute. Along came beside her. Wait a minute. Little Miss Muffet sat on a tuffet, eating her curbs well. Along beside her came a spider and s scared Miss Tuffet away. Is that a nursery rhyme, y'all? I believe it is. I don't know if I got it right or not. But Cynthia is in the house all by herself. Yes, she's on her own. Once again, I by myself that's cynthia bailey honey because her allies which was shauna and carson are no longer there the only person that's there that she could talk to is herself pretty much because don't nobody else like her don't nobody else like it and i'm gonna say well job cynthia because i thought you were gonna be gone way before shauna and definitely way before Carson. Because I thought Carson had it in him to win. But it seems like that's not the case. Because he gone, okay? When he had time to get rid of Misha. Misha is a UF, you, what do you call a UFC fighter. A ultimate fighting champion. She kickbox or, 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 or martial arts fight. That girl is bad. And she's there to win. Now, Todrick, he's a hot mess. Now, I heard that he used to get plays and do plays and hire people for plays. And he don't like paying people their money. So, I was like, okay, okay. He a hot mess. Moving on from him. Because if he don't pay to play, then I don't know why he here. Okay? Man, he just seemed like a follower. People say Cynthia's a follower, which is true. Uh, but they said um, Todrick is a follower as well. And a no good person. So, he's a hot mess. Moving on to the next person. We have Lamar Odom. I hell, I don't know why he here. <laughs> <laughs> and most of the people probably didn't know why he here either. Why he ain't gone, honey? Why he ain't gone? Jesus, because he's sitting up there talking about he won't Khloe Kardashian back. So we need to return him to the streets from which he came from. He was made to be messy. Okay, moving on to number three. Come on, my slide. There she go. That's the girl, Misha Tate, to be scared of. Yes, honey, she's part of the UFC, and she claimed to come in there with business that she's going to take that $250,000 and do it and make it do. She coming for the money. That's all, that's all that woman is about, money and prestige, and she's going to get her just due. And that means getting the players out of the house one by one. I think she's toying with Cynthia. She's probably giving Cynthia the illusion that she can win. <laughs> when I'm like, well, if Dom was a factor and Dom and Dom are trying to play the game, then yeah, Cynthia may be a worthy opponent because nobody expected her to get this far. She's with, now, wait, what is it now? It's five of y'all. It's supposed to come down to the ultimate four or something to that degree. But if Todd Bridges is not there, then they are down to the final four. But if they have anything to do with it, they going to have Cynthia go out the door, the next person to be vetoed. Because I don't even think she won a challenge being in the Brick Brothers house. I mean, I've been watching it here and there, but I haven't been full focused on it. And I thought I could possibly watch it. But I'm like, nah, I can't. I can't and I won't. I won't do it. I won't subject myself to such torment okay but now we get down to Todd Bridges if he's still there and I think he is okay because I haven't seen him do his farewell speech or whatnot but y'all correct me if I'm wrong and Todd Bridges had already got on uh Cynthia ass okay he said he wasn't the one and she better not be trudging down that street that he's riding no and now her allies are gone allies are gone which was definitely Carson because Carson was taken up for her and you know Tom uh Bridges ain't nothing but a total hot mess okay but who is going to save her now who is going to save uh Cynthia from Misha Todrick Lamar and Todd Bridges 
nobody because the only person that in, is in the house that seemed like they have an ally is Todrick and Misha. And I like that 22 behind her. That's my birthday month. Well, my, the day I was born on the 22nd of January. Okay. But, child, yes. I was like, oh, Lord. And I was just reading some of the comments. A lot of people don't like Cynthia. I thought it was just me. I mean, I don't have a disregard for her. I just don't like her stupidity. You know, because I'm like, damn, are you that dumb? You know what I'm saying? That's all she has ever given me on the Real Housewives of Atlanta and everywhere else. It's just stupidity. Now, her daughter could definitely take her place and be cemented in the industry and be a, a force to be reckoned with. But I, I just don't know where we get Cynthia from. You know what I'm saying? Maybe she's that neutral balance that you need to have. But she's not the sharpest tool in the shed. Okay? I would not put her on my team because I would probably have to uh, 86 her. If one incident that went wrong, I would just be like, go and get out. You, you just bad karma. Got to go, you know, that kind of thing. But, honey, they are being messy on Miss Cynthia in the comment section of Big Brother. Let me just read you some of them, honey. One of them said, Cynthia is a follower and, should, and she's beyond gullible. Just a bird brain. And I'm beyond annoyed with how rude she was to Shannon. Um, Shauna. Uh, speaking as if she knew what she was talking about. But that's because I think she is truly doesn't know how to play the game. Now, I just want to watch how she reacts to realizing that she's being played. Another thing I realize is that for her to be that old, her way of thinking is very juvenile and childlike. Like the way she rationalized the information being presented to her and she just fell for it easily and ready to attack. She doesn't know how to be... Slow to anger, slow to speak, yet quick to listen. <laughs> I was like, damn, was that a read? Was that a read? But, you know, I, I don't really know how to play Big Brother, so I'm not going to entertain y'all like I know what I'm talking about because I don't, okay? But I'm just assuming that it's a, a game that's really made up on manipulation. And trying to undermine somebody else. And a lot of hearsay being thrown at people just to see which way the wind would blow. If you gave them a little bit of false information. Now that's just my take on it. Y'all get uh, in the comments and tell me if I'm right or wrong. But the players that they had trying to play the game. I just wasn't interested in them. It's self like I said. Teddy Middlecamp. I was you know okay. She was giving me something. And I kind of like Shayna to a certain point. But Carson was the one I had really wanted to get down there and win. And then his old crazy butt got uh, evicted. When he should have took Misha out when he had the chance. But listening to old Cynthia. Uh, that's just kind of fucked him up pretty much. <laughs> and then again, he might have just been tired of the whole Big Brother scene. And he just had to go bye-bye. And I'm like, okay, baby, go. Go on if you got to go. So he played a, uh, just a piss-poor game towards the end. And that's why he got 86 out of there. Because when he could have took Misha out, he didn't. So, uh, it just is what it is on that one. Um, then somebody said... Cynthia and Carson will be really surprised when they get to watch the episodes play them like fools, okay? Another one said, you are correct. Cynthia never took a leadership stand, nor does she pay attention to everyone. Of course, it was easy for Todrick to manipulate her. Okay. Then Lamar clearly hyped up the fight between Cynthia and Todd with all. But I gagged when Cynthia said to Todd, I don't want your vote or your ribs. <laughs> I'm like, was he cooking real that night, girl? And you had smelled them, and you just really uh, wanted to see what they taste like. You were licking your lips and everything, and thinking how it's going to slide down your throat. Girl, please, if you get out of here, honey. But that is funny. They are tearing Cynthia Bailey up. And uh, one person said they were pissed when Carson and Cynthia uh, fell for Tajik and Misha's bullshit, and with no questions asked. I like, yeah, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Then another person said, I had to release my disappointment in Cynthia and Carson. Just respect uh, the fact uh, of Todrick's game. As much as I hate to admit it, that man has been scheming since he sat down his luggage. And he's effing good at it. I thought that he was going to crash and burn with the 50-11 alliances he set up as soon as he walked in. But damn, he is good. Okay, and that's why I said stupid is a stupid does. I don't know why. Uh, they haven't got, maybe they just playing, like I say, toying with Cynthia, Misha them is. And they just wanted her to be like, it's going to be fine or four, but she ain't going to be in there. 
and they want to get rid of her at this point now i think they rather get rid of todd than cynthia first but cynthia is on the chopping block because i definitely see um todd still there because misha thinks he's going to be maybe her best competitor on winning the game or whatnot which it just is what it is you know what i'm saying because he came to play too and he's just uh turning people also around um away from each other and and making enemies as he's going along but it would be very interesting to see who would be next to go cynthia or todd that is my two um people that i know are going to go that are not going to win but like i said i didn't expect cynthia to be on this long as well but since she has no allies to help her think on which way she should move and navigate through this situation she's gonna be next i do believe all right um let me see carson and cynthia are here looking real cheap town about uh misha has no reason to lie she's absolutely has every reason to lie <laughs> so basically they're calling um cynthia as well as um carson fools for listening to todrick and all of his mess um then let me see it, it was just a real hot mess everybody's just trying to figure out why carson let uh misha and tried to trick him because i think he was a fan favorite as well uh to wanting to win and then he wanted to do something real cute and honorable with his money he was going to donate his wins to a charity so I, I i was like yeah okay i can understand that i like that i, I you know that's very admirable of him but uh, i don't know what cynthia plans on doing with her money i don't know you know what i'm saying she might give it all to uh peter again or excuse me or she might give it to mike you know but that's the big brother recap i got y'all get down in them comments y'all tell me what's going on what's going on i'll tell you what's going on whoo yes honey because we being straight and messy don't nobody wants uh don't, don't nobody really in the comments of that particular episode that i looked at on my phone of celebrity big brother uh the ousting of our last person that had to leave which was carson they don't like cynthia <laughs> uh cynthia is still giving us fashion and face but upstairs where it really matters the most in her intellect everybody's dogging her out they putting her out to the woods honey they threw her to the woods and she didn't come back running the pack she came back on the uh, receiving but in okay they recruited her to be a follower because that's all she do she likes to smell ass she don't know anything about leadership and leading okay leading the pack is what i'm saying when they throw you to the wolves you're supposed to be coming back like a g running things okay you in the you in the front okay they thought you were gonna be devoured and trampled on but you came back I mean, you fought your way through all of that madness and you still came out on top because you coming back leading the pack, baby. But that's not what's happening, girl. <laughs> they are toying with you and they're trying to make you think that you're going to be in the click. You're going to be in the final four. You're going to be possibly a winner. No, because see, long as y'all kept Misha in the house, y'all had ample enough time to get rid of her she's just feeding you to the slaughter just baiting you to the slaughter it's just like throwing a fishing pole with the line with the fake fish on the end just tempting trying to masquerade as a fish there until you come closer or you think you want to eat that fish and you bite on that hook uh-uh and then the person start reeling your ass in that's what misha is going to do to cynthia okay and like but like i said todrick might get to her first now uh, Lamar Odom, I don't think he really care whether he win or not. If he got the money, you know we think he going to do. It's going to go straight up his nose, okay, or in his arm. Because that's, 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 that's the way it is, especially if he's sitting there ain't had not one child with Khloe Kardashian, but he want her back. <laughs> I'm like, backtrack, back, back, honey, get back, okay. She don't want you, Lamar. She don't want you. She wants a man that, like, play on her right now, which is that Tristan. Because he's still hyped up in the game, uh, you know, in the basketball game. And he's going to be still doing his thing. And, you know, it's just see what it is. Now, she done anything bad. It's like she really messed you up, uh, Lamar. She's getting her karma back dealt to her. Okay? The universe is dealing with her 
on their time not your time but that's all i have for this video guys like it love it gotta have more but honey who y'all want to see when big brother get down in the comments let's talk about it and do you think cynthia is on her way out or you think she's a formative player that will, can possibly win the game okay through her stupidity through her gullibleness through her naiveness let us sister know okay we fine we can talk about it we ain't gonna definitely argue about it but we can definitely speak our minds and our opinions because that's all that matters over here everybody getting the shit off their chest speaking to what they feel is right or wrong with what are we talking about and we move on to the next subject topic you understand what i'm saying we can't fester on one topic because there's too many to share out there <laughs> okay so we need to keep up all right and that's all i got for this video i will see y'all next time bye bye